Got them fishing poles loaded up. Ain't nothing but a Jeep thing. Finna ride out. About to head out to the lake. Going up to uh, Bull Shoals Lake. It ain't far from here where I live at. I do a little fishing. A little looking around at stuff. And uh, I'll try my suspension out a little bit too. I got that new sway bar and all that on the front and shocks also all the way around and I ain't been off road a little bit. It ain't really ain't off road and it's just kind of lake road riding more or less than anything. But anyway, I'm gonna turn this thing off because I ain't gonna be videoing while I'm driving. All right, y'all be cool. We'll get back with you in a minute. All right, we got her in four wheel drive. But a thing right there. A piece of cake. Alright, y'all hang on. It wasn't bad. I didn't have to spin all them tires, but hell, it's been a while. All right, so we'll see if I can zoom in on this. You see them bloomed out little bushes right there? All right there. Gar I guarantee you, I promise you, them's wild plums. And I never know they was there until just now. So that's a score. That right there made this whole trip worthwhile. Got you under a couple more of them plum trees. Anyway, like I was saying, I got the grass cut this morning. I didn't do a whole lot. Had to do a little tinkering on the push mower to, to get it working, but got the grass cut and got the clippings and some leaves kind of put up in a pile back there on my, my little mulch junk. Look like there's been quite a few people. Oh, there's some people back here already. Maybe they fishing and ain't studying what I'm thinking. Oh, they all kind of people back in here. Well, we just gonna ease right on past them. They some good, well, nah, they really ain't no good fishing back in here. <laughs> ain't. Ain't no sense in wasting no time coming back in here. I don't even know how to stop down here and tell these people to go somewhere else. They just ain't no ain't, ain't even gonna catch nothing. They crazy. I tell you right now, the water is up, boy. I mean, it's up. Let me turn this thing around so you can see a little bit. All right. You see old old lake right there. I don't know how many people out here. I guess them's four-wheelers. I, I might have counted them four-wheelers as people. Yeah, they ain't, ain't no good fishing out here. Shoot, I guarantee you they're catching the hell out of some catfish. 
There's some good flathead catfish coming out of here. Yeah, I may have to park back over here. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to get out that road. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to get across this dip right here. Hey, they got across that dip, I'll get across it. He ain't scared. Might be scared, I don't know. Let's see how deep that thing is. Yeah, it ain't that deep. Let's see. Normally this right here ain't but about maybe a 10 or 15 foot wide little old spot creek of water running down through here. Look like them carp are out. See, normally the road goes back up through yonder, but I always this old rock just kind of, kind of funny to me. It's just out here in the middle of nowhere. I'm trying not to tear things up too bad, but. Dang gone, you can see people been out here just a rutting and a cutting. I'm gonna go ahead and put this thing in four-wheel drive just to be on the safe side. We winching. She bogged down. We buried we buried it to the axle. This ain't good. This ain't good at all. We're just about 35 inches deep. We used to do this kind of stuff all the time when we were young and stupid and all that. But we've gotten older, supposedly wiser, but maybe not. Anywho, he's done buried his truck up, or excuse me, his Jeep up. And now we have to see if we can't get this thing out of here. See how ugly that is? That is ugly, ugly stuff. You would think before he made it that far, he would have probably stopped back here. But I guess not. 
Anywho, now he's got to try to go way over there and see if he can't find a tree that's going to hold to pull him out. And the funny thing about this is he just changed out some parts on the front end that he's got to take back off and do some stuff with. And that stuff is buried. Good God. Oh well. Live and learn don't apply here, huh?